All right, here it is. I've been under the weather lately, so excuse my voice, but I'm still hungry no matter how sick I get. Let's try it out. Nice setup here. All right, so you get the uh, coleslaw. I can't wait. Love pickles and coleslaw. So Sarge's Deli. This is what we're here for. Sarge's. It's the Snapple Razzo. Beefy butcher dogs. No sugar, both flakes of garlic and onion with a buttery umami flavor. So I ordered these. I'm excited to try these out. So what did I get? If we flip through the menu. The hot dog corner here. And the sauerkraut, coleslaw, chili cheese, pastrami. So guess what I got? I got three of them. I got wrapped in pastrami. Can't wait to try that out. Chili and cheese, and then the coleslaw. All right, so you guys ready for this? Let's start with the first one. The coleslaw, it's just coleslaw right over it. And we got the pastrami dog. And then the chili. You just put the chili right on top of the cheese. All right, my mic is long enough, which is great. So let's start off. You know what? I wanted to snap this one first. This looks like a really good dog. I mean, it's like a weird, it says umami taste. Umami to me is like, you know, like kimchi. That's umami to me, like a seafood taste, fermented taste, not seafood, just fermented. Mm. Crazy snap. It's a Slim Jim. First reaction, it's a Slim Jim. I should have just gotten a regular hot dog. It's a Slim Jim. It reminds me of the um, the chorizo one that we had. Chistora. I should have just gotten their regular beef hot dog. I'm going to order one. When she comes over, I'm going to let her know. Let me just get a regular beef one. Uh, regular beef with sauerkraut. I'll get a New Yorker. I already know I'm not going to like this too much. It's a Slim Jim. So let's start off with this one. Say with the coleslaw. It's Slim Jim with bread and coleslaw. Let me add some mustard. They got their own uh, deli mustard here. I gotta add some flavor. There's no flavor. So this is the coleslaw that they serve, which is great. Really good coleslaw. I'm a huge coleslaw guy. I'm a big pickle guy too. Say, better crunch on the pickle, really good. Man, I really wanted this to be the Snapple Razzo, whatever it's called, to be something different. It's a Slim Jim, it's almost like a fermented hot dog. Could you imagine that? A fermented hot dog. One more bite, and then I'll keep going. All right, let me prep this chili dog. I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm gonna do mustard. Line of mustard. And then, uh, oh, there's beans in this chili. Look away. Chili fans, look away. This thing looks like it was it's microwaved. It's, it's microwaved uh, craft cheese. There you go. Chili and cheese. Cheese just like expected, like a cheese whiz style. The chili is thick, very thick sauce. The bean chunks are bigger than the meat chunks. I'm not liking this hot dog, man. It's a Slim Jim. I'm gonna ask her. It does have a snap, but it's like a fake snap. Not like a skin, like oh, like I said, it's almost like a fermented, like they hung these things out to dry. It's like a sausage. It's like it's like a, it's like getting a sopressata. 
Uh, you hang a, you hang it once it's ready. You put it in here, put some chili on it. Like it, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Raleigh's had the melted um, mozzarella, which I thought was a really good touch. You have to, you have to add uh, mustard. Pastrami is good. You really can't taste the hot dog because the pastrami taste is overpowering. Pastrami with with deli mustard is one of the top meals you can get. Let me see if I made a huge mistake. I'm gonna order the uh, beef hot dog. Can I buy you for an all beef hot dog instead just of a the one? one? Yeah, just a regular Anything all beef. On it? So, uh, so sauerkraut. Do you have like red onions? Okay. Like uh, like a uh, sauce? Onion yeah. sauce? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, so I'll do mustard, sauerkraut, onions okay. with the onion sauce. Thank you. All right, now I'm more excited about that. She looked like, sh she was like, that's gonna be better than this. Yeah, I think I made a mistake with this Randazzo one. Now let's see what the pricing is, because they said $7.95 per hot dog. And the re regular hot dog, all beef is, is $5.95, so let's make a comparison. So this video might be longer than I expected. You know what, I wanna show you. This is it. It's like I'm eating deer meat. Deer, um, deer jerky. I can't even talk. <laughs> it's like deer jerky. I was choking. Since I'm waiting, I might as well rate them, right? So let's start with the first one. The coleslaw, um, the coleslaw hot dog. Coleslaw is like, it's just coleslaw. They just slapped it on there, nothing special. Same coleslaw you get when you walk in. Hot dog, it did not like the bread, very fresh. I give it like a 6.2, 6 6.2. Good, but it's not, no. I, the chili itself with the cheese, I give it a little higher, probably 6.8, 6.9. And then the pastrami one, which is the excellent, the best one out of all of them. Just because the pastrami itself, you really don't feel the hot dog because the pastrami is overpowering. I would give this one a 7.2. So if you do an all beef hot dog with the pastrami and with the mustard, I would, I feel like that might hit the eights. It might hit the eights. Let me try, let me try the other end of this one. Yeah. 7.2 is fair. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like the all beef hot dog more than these. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Do you want me to get rid of any of these? Uh, I'm gonna, to go? To I'll go, take, okay. Yep, <laughs> thank you. Oh, I knew it, I knew it. Look at this. I knew this was gonna be much better. So let me just put some mustard on there. Yeah, I'm done. Thank you so much. I'll put some mustard right here on the side, right on top of the kraut. Mustard always goes first. You know that, but I couldn't do much if this is loaded with toppings. Oh, look at the hot dog. This is much different. Even the feel, much different. Oh, I can't wait now. I knew it, I made a huge mistake. I should have had the all beef. Look at this baby. Mm. Mm. Much better than the other one, the hot dog itself. And the onion sauce was, was completely different. The sauerkraut's really good. I'm gonna have that separately. Crunchy and fresh. The onion sauce is really, really good. Homemade onion sauce, you can tell. You can tell just the way the onions are cooked. The onion sauce is a little thicker and you can feel some like ketchup, right? It's not, it's not simmered to a point that you don't feel the ketchup as much. This one's like a little thicker with the ketchup. 
which is still pretty good. But the hot dog, you guys heard the snap, much, much better, much better. This is my kind of dog, completely different. That's an 8.8. .8. It just had a lot of, uh, they just put a lot of toppings on there for me, but this is an 8.8. .8. The hot dog is, what a completely different taste. This makes sense for a, for a New Year's style deli. This hot dog makes sense. The others didn't. I don't know what they're trying to do with those, but I'll put up the pricing that you can see. This one's a home run. And the bread's nice and soft, so it picks up all the um, juices. This is what I was looking for. This is what I was hoping for. Now I gotta come back and try the pastrami wrapped in, in the beef. Snapple Razzo. What was I thinking? More people coming in. natural casing hot dog what a big difference what a big difference waiting staff's amazing all diners have really good waiting staff Sarge's come in get the, the all beef hot dog 100% beef hot dog don't get anything else I got gimmicked I got a mess all these plates over here it's just a mess but I finished the, the all beef one that that one is worth it. All right. Look at this. Yep. Told you. Snapper Razzo. Bun and Colso is nine bucks. Snapper Razzo with the pastrami, twelve. Snapper Razzo with the chili and cheese, ten. So between both of them, between the three of them, 10, let's say 22, and 9, 31, I paid $31. And all three together were not as good as the Frank on a bun with mustard and sour for $6. Sometimes simple is better. Instead, I, I got gimmicked with the Snapple Razzle, but it won't happen again, and it won't happen to you guys. Definitely don't try it. All right, Sarge's Deli. See you, Sarge's. I got a goodie bag. These are all the uh, the leftover Snapple Razzos that I didn't eat. I'm gonna throw it to the pigeons, but I'm scared they're gonna throw it back. The other hot dog, the all beef, that was that was legit. That's a good one. So not only is it better, it's a lot less. Six bucks. Simplicity is always better. Just a nice simple hot dog, you know. Nice simple toppings. I'm walking back up midtown. For all you New Yorkers, ex-New Yorkers, if you remember this spot, it was, uh, it's where Dukes used to be. Now it's a decor art gallery. Miss Dukes. Cheap drinks, watch a game, have fun. All right, guys, I hope you enjoy it. Let me know what you think in the comments below, all right? Bye.